when we talk about human capital, we talk about the knowledge, the skills, the health and resilience that people accumulate over their lifetime and which are instrumental to unlock their potential. The 2020 Human Capital Index update tells us that countries have been successful in improving their human capital over the past decade. Unfortunately, COVID-19 poses a serious threat to these gains. Countries are now tackling very difficult challenges, containing the virus and rebuilding their economies. As they do so, the Human Capital Index can be a useful tool to track changes in human capital and inform policies to protect it and to invest in people during the pandemic and beyond. Five things you need to know about the 2020 Human Capital Index. With the addition of 17 countries, the 2020 update includes the most recent health and education data for 174 countries. That's 98% of the world's population. Thanks to a decade-long view, the index can help to track the evolution of human capital from 2010 to 2020 for over 100 countries. The index now contains gender disaggregated data for over 150 countries to help us better understand gender inequalities. It presents a complementary measure that explores how well a country utilizes its human capital potential. And with data right up to March 2020, before the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic, it serves as a baseline to track changes and inform approaches to protecting and investing in people through the pandemic and beyond. With powerful data visualizations and intuitive navigation, you can explore the Human Capital Index for yourself. See how your country has progressed and compare outcomes. The 2020 HCI allows us to see and speak to the need to continue protecting and investing in people. More than ever, we need resilient and inclusive systems that put people at the center.